It's my new micro CNC router from Lumen Lab. And it put a dot there. Alright, now we're rolling. This is code from Eagle. And I used PCBG code to convert it. I had to hand edit this file though because it was pretty messed up. I don't like G0 codes. I'd rather have a G1. Kind of set my marker a little tight. You can't tell the letter T. Alright, this is uh, my website. Shame, shameless promotion here. This is my lovely Pentium 3 computer. Alright, we're about to take this thing to the home. Now with finer tipped machines, the spindle installed, that would be real nice. And it stops a quarter of an inch from hitting the blocks. We got one more that will run, and this is hand coded G code. And you'll tell by the block letters. And I don't know if you can see the letters underneath, but it's following the exact lines that I drew about a hundred times already. I just threw a new sheet up. It's worth learning G-code because the file, even PCB G-code is not perfect. And it's good to be able to notice if there's a mistake. Especially when it comes to taking this thing home. Alright, here we go. Now I hand coded this, it could go wacky. Oh yes. So there you go, I try to keep it short, two minutes and 25 seconds to this point. Just look at the uh, screen, that's EMC2. Really easy to use once you get the hang of it. And that is the Lumen Lab Micro CNC Router. It really is not a figment of our imagination. Thank you. Uh, this is tech-tut.com signing off. It's more than just a project, too. I'll add that. It's just awesome.